Ah, dang. So another episode of Mega Ruby Randomizer. Like last time we left off as on our way to the next city. And uh I think you have to go along the cycling road. What did I do? Did I save last time? Or buy Pokeballs? Or run this down. Like I know I can do this contest to get a free Pikachu of I learned that you can do that. But basically, uh you know last time when we went on route 110 and we found our you know Velto in here because Velto. And there was a group of Magma members going up here. But I think we I learned that I don't have to go that way. Uh, if I remember correctly, you have to go in here to the cycling route and go up cycling to get to the third gym. Sorry, but you can walk on the cycling road, it's too dangerous. Please come with a bike. Oh. I need to find a bike. Okay, we'll get a bike there. Okay. Time to find a bike. Time to find a bike, I guess. I find a bike here. I didn't want to run on the tree. I was like, did I even do this out? <laughs> I don't know. <do> you. <laughs> I hope to do the third uh, gym today. I hope. But you never know what your pregnant girl does. Also, my Mr. Kai looks a back. You see? Like, the belly fits still nice within this one. Oh. Like, uh. Still in still. I still in level 35. I think it's level 34. I was gonna set up, okay. Uh, but I've been basically like, I've been like two, three months pregnant now. Yeah, in two months, in two months. And it lights up with like basically what I expected. Uh, that's Ali's child because basically, you know, we're just a couple and he wants to go get sex. Yes, you know, those are normal couple things do. But I never expected to be get pregnant. So yeah, I took it a bit more. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. Because I can't say that out loud on YouTube. So if the video gets monetized, but. Uh, a fighting Pokemon, eh? So. So it lines up with, like. You know, me getting pregnant and that sort of stuff. But I never expected it. So I, it was like. I just got barely, like, most of my Sakai looks. But the point is, like. I just barely got my Sakai looks also two months ago in a week. In the two weeks before I went uh, six for a few weeks because I got morning, you know, morning amnesia. Uh, I basically got my Sakai dresses and it was like, well, I got pregnant now. I can't very really wear my Sakai dresses anymore. So. That was once again bulk up. So I was like, let me try to go to the Sakai to see if my Sakai dresses still, you know, work. One shot that it is plus two. So, and I shot it with Leonid, and as you can see, it still fits. Uh, after that, I went to one more jump, the dress still fitted, and we're like, Oh, you're pregnant, Elise? I'm like, Yeah, I guess. I guess I'm pregnant. Leonid was not around, and I didn't sell any of the folk loads there, so. Uh, I should just fake out. Oh, I'm quicker. Doesn't do anything. Oh, we're speed tied, really? Speed tied basically means uh, it goes random which one is first. Since I went first last time, that means we're speed tied. But so I started with one more jump. They were there and were like, You're pregnant, and he's like, Oh, good guess. And I was like, Yeah, my boyfriend, you know, I'm pregnant, and I didn't expect it, you know, because I'm touching the girl one. I 
was thinking, uh, before I go on with like my dress story, uh, I was thinking, I was thinking, I should capture your vehicle because I clearly have a dress weakness in my team. So. Because. Oh well. So we talked a bit, well, you know, since I'm a transgender girl, but I apparently get, uh, got pregnant on our Sakai travels. It's cool, Birch. I want to learn that with Protect. So, uh, and then I went away, and then I went to VBS, and my VBS. That's still perfect, but my belly was a bit. I don't know, I think I pressed my belly a bit backwards. I don't know, it felt like my belly is not as big, you know. You know, I have quite a big belly at this point, but. Yeah, my pregnant belly got quite big. Ow! Oh! It is evolving into plus story. As you can see, my belly got quite big quite fast. So it's just either a bit tightened, or not as big as I expected. Maybe my belly is still smaller and just becomes bigger in this test because, you know, it has more room to wiggle around. And there's our first fully evolved Pokemon, by the way. But we lost four against the Pokemon. <laughs> you know. So, ah. Uh, so that's maybe one thing why it's smaller. It feels smaller. I don't know if it looks smaller. Maybe, hey, maybe you can judge. You can judge. Maybe it looks smaller, but maybe it's me. Here. Uh, does this look smaller? Feels, I don't know, it feels smaller. But, uh, you know, what am I going to say? Oh yeah, then I went to uh, Wonderland Showtime and they have a dress still hanging on the plaza. And we're like, oh, you're pregnant at least? And it was like, yep. Same story, I talked a bit, uh, a bit, a bit with them and then uh, <laughs> they offered me the dress and helped me in it. It still fitted quite nicely, but uh, uh, it did rip a bit, quite uh, just small pieces. They were like, you show where you wear it? And it was like, yeah, you know, I'm just gonna wiggle around with it. Like a big one, like, whoop, 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 whoop. And I swear every time, every time. Let me go back to my Leonid dress, Leonid dress because I wanted to go to the uh, report in that. But let me know, do you think my belly is bigger in my Leonid dress or in this one? Because I feel, it feels bigger. Maybe just stupid. Maybe it's a bit bigger, maybe it's less bigger because I'm wearing two skirts on that. The two skirt piece, so... <laughs> but I swear to God, like... I swear to God, huh? I swear to God. Every time I go to the Wonderland, okay, this little dragon here, this little piece of shit, runs around away, and I get searched around it. And when I was not pregnant, you know, this was fine. I just run around, played with plushies there that are our life. And, uh... It was a lot of time, and then when I wanted to go, it always flew back to me. And now when I have to look for it, it's so undoable. It was like a bunch of pregnant walking around with a big body. Luckily, if I just call it, my, my little pet dragon, she comes back. But I swear every time, I every time lose her, because she's playing around with the plushies. <laughs> was really good. And then, uh, of course, as last I went to uh, night court, the night court Sakai, the empty Sakai, and tried my dress on there. So, and I still... Well, still fitted, still worked, so, but as I said, I don't know, like I said, uh, maybe it's me, but I still think like out of all the bell, out of all my, of all the dresses, my belly looks the smallest, this one, because, uh, as you see, this, this is the VBS dress, I'm gonna have people in the comments say, at your belly doesn't look that small, this is my more and more gem dress, you know, the idol Sakai, quite big, it's quite, has some wiggle room in it. And this is, in case you have missed it, my Sakai dress, if you want to know how it looks. This is my uh, Wonderland X6 Sakai dress, as you can see it ripped a bit, but not that much. So, I still want to wear it from time to time. And as Leslie, uh, yeah, let us Leslie, here's my Night Court, you know, emo Sakai dress. As I said, still fits, so, happy with it. But let, let me know. Like, I wanna just wanna know. And maybe it's like, at least you're asking the right questions. Like my pregnancy. Because I'm a pregnant girl with this. Do you think... Do you think this was the smallest belly that I have in all my dresses? Of the Sakai dresses that I showed you? And I know it's a weird question, but just play my pregnancy. Because I, I wanna know. I don't know. It feels... 
<laughs> You'd be like, Elise, why are, you, why are you asking? Elise, why are you talking about that? Sorry. I know my belly is still the same size as the others, but if you have more Rico women later, we need. Oh well. But that's the thing, like my psychiatrist has got a return. I gotta make returns. Iron, ironic before I continue. This is a really good uh lead. Oh, that hits everything. Oh, I forgot that it's thunder. It's really quick. It's not gonna hurt. Oh wait, it's gonna on the ground, so I still hit. I killed my own rin, but... So my Sakadras is gonna make a return, I'm really happy with it, that they still fit also. And yeah. I, like I like I said. It's been a, it's been an actually like a few months of me not going to any Sakai besides my own and my boyfriend Sakai, you know, Ellie of Sakai. But yeah, there were like I've been to all the all, all of the Sakai's in the last week. Uh without people or you know, with people if they are there. Oh, that is a finally evolving. But I've been to all the guys with people around to see if my uh just tell them, you know. Because basically, uh over the over the few weeks, over the months that I, you know. Oh, V Brava. Finally evolving. But over the few weeks that I've been, of course, uh when I first got my transformation I learned that I got the travel Sakai's. Uh, let's do Earth Power. Over the course of the weeks that I learned that I could travel Sakai, I went to different uh, Sakai that you guys know as the Project Sakai game Sakai, like the school Sakai and that sort of stuff. I spent most of my time studying the unique Sakai, so I became basically best friends with Saki, Ich Ichika there, and so on, so on. So I made, f like, Omiku is evolving too! A lot of evol uh, evolutions this day. This kid is dang. Our first Rin, now Len, now Miku. Mm. But basically, I went to another Shikai and became friends with those people, really good friends. So I felt like obliged to show. I, feel, I felt a bit obliged. Is it me? Should I? No, of course, I don't have to show them that I'm pregnant and I don't have to tell them I come back after my three years of pregnancy, you know, which I'm probably gonna have. So. But I'm a lot of trainers on these routes. I don't think I have to go that way. I don't think about it. Poke Fan Migo or Vulpix. But, uh, as I said, I felt obliged to at least tell my friends that I'm pregnant so that they know, you know, that they know in case, uh, in case I come less often. I told them in. Safeguard. So at least I didn't feel obliged because I don't have to tell my friends that I'm pregnant, of course. But if I see my friends, it's, as I said, pretty hard to hide at this point. <laughs> my baby belly. As I said, why did it feel for VBS? Why did it feel shorter? I don't know. <laughs> like, I can't hide it at this point anymore. Just look at my baby bump. So big. Mm. You will think that I'm like 9 months pregnant or something, or 12 months at this point, but no. Just 3 months pregnant. Basically, this is the second one my belly appeared. So I, sh I assume that I'm 2 months pregnant. You know, just assuming. Maybe I've been pregnant for longer, who knows. But, uh... Yeah, as I said, I felt obliged to tell my friends, at least so they know, in case I just don't come... Uh, don't come to their Sakai's, uh, to their Sakai's as often as possible. So as often as I did previously, that I know that it's my pregnancy, you know, that I'm just taking some time off, relax a bit. I still want to go to them, I still go to them from like time to time, but just like once in a month or something now. Like once a time. Like once a week or something. Instead of every day almost. Or twice a day, twice, twice a week. I try to go at least once a month to every sick guy now that I'm pregnant. Because, uh, as I said. 
I want, I want at least uh, support my fans in making their own songs. And, uh, yeah. At least it's like I want to support them still, but you know, you're pregnant, so I can't come around there, you know. I can't come there and be like, oh, I'm gonna join you, I'm gonna have some fun, and be like, dance around to sing. I still can sing, because I still do it with Elif. But, uh,. I still sing with Ellie from time to time, but like I don't dance as much as I do anymore. <laughs> I don't do that as much. Because you know. Pregnant and dancing is sometimes like fun TikTok content. Oh, I still had to fight that kid? Why didn't I do that in the last time? Oh well. Uh like I still do it, but like I can't for long times go towards a Sakai. Because being pregnant is really exhausting, and you know it's really mentally, uh, and not in a bad way, but you have to, have to think. You have to think. You have to think. You have to think. I've been a trans girl, so I never had the possibility to get pregnant. And now, of course, thanks to my Sakai travels, my powers, and my transformation, I apparently uh, have become pregnant. So one of my dreams came true. I still sort of speak. Hmm. One of my dreams came through and I love it. But it's so mentally exhausting because I've had like a ch uh, my Twitch chat of course now knows. But uh <laughs> But my Twitch chat knows of course and I've been talking like a lot like talking about carving for example because that's such a thing and eh? like that you end up walking out today uh, for example that I'm uh that I'm uh that I'm with Elif at his place, you know, and I'm just basically we're walking outside for an, like a nice walk, and he lists. What's that move? I wasn't paying attention. He lists like near the forest area. Oh, doesn't do a lot. Super effective. A chip away. I can survive a chip away. Uh, so he lives near a forest area also, but he lives also on the edge of his, like... You know, on, on, like the city where he lives, like Boxel it was. He doesn't mind if I say it on content creation. So... Uh, so he often go for like a walk in the, in the forest, which is really, really lovely and nice. He's such a sweet dude. Believe me. He does really take care of me. But... Uh, what was I saying again? Oh yeah, singing and dancing, and how pregnancy is mentally exhausting. Kaputu. Uh. That is like exhausting, because uh, it takes some effort from your body, because your body has to adapt to you like... I had big tits before I became pregnant. You know, okay, I had like quite a booba, but you know. Watch my previous videos, sissies, theories on this. Uh, start by episode one. You see that I quite quite a booba register. That's an endure thing. But uh, so, like I said, for example, Twitch chat. If I'm talking about carvings, and like I said, if I go on the walk with Elif and we're just walking in the forest, and I suddenly get carving for like. Uh, mint chocolate ice cream because oh, oh mint chocolate ice cream is so nicely yeah. and know why especially with this warm weather oh I want some chocolate cookies with like a rainbow dip this is now I want again but if you never walk out in the middle of the forest you know uh move like if you keep like if for example if you want to uh if you get the carvings in the middle of the forest, you can't really go like quickly back and help your carvings. So you like you can either go walking on with like your carvings, and then when you, once you go uh, back to the city, get your ice cream. Oh wait, I for I forget. There's like a rival battle here. Hold on. Uh, get your like carvings, that sort of stuff. Then help out, or you go back, but then ruin the walk a bit because you want some ice cream. And Elif is like. 
Elif is supportive and knows about it, and it's like he doesn't mind, but I don't want to go always back for some stupid food or ice cream. You know? Even if I carve my ass off, I won't. But also, I think like what Twitch, Twitch said recently, and it's been over the past few months, I don't know if you think about it, or as Elif. Like someone in my chat said, uh, we were talking about like my uh, my last six months for our uh, education, basically, or my last six months for my. Yeah, nay. Let me say it correctly. We were talking a bit about my last six months uh, up ahead that I have to go for my education, basically my last semester. You know, while I'm packing and that sort of stuff. Basically, I'm going on an internship. And one of my uh, viewers mentioned, mentioned that, so all you do is like, oh, so you're a software developer. I was like, yes, I study software developing. I study software development, so do you know. You learned about this girl, pregnant girl something, yeah? And I'll go, to, I'll go talk about preg pregnancy in school a bit for now, you know, later. But uh, he was like, oh, so all you have to do later is just like sit at your desk, pat your belly, you know, hand on your belly, pat your belly, and just write some code. And I was like, yeah, basically. But then that, that made me also realize something. You know why? Uh, the thing that it made me realize is, basically, I've been, like, I asked Elif after that stream, uh, like, babe, do I really show my belly off quite often? He was like, yeah, you tend to, like, lean forward more with your hand on your belly, babe. Or sweetheart. It was like, at least you tend to do that a lot. Like, I just walk around a bit and then, you know, with my, uh, like with my, sh with my back a bit forward and my hand on my belly. I, I, a lot of pregnant women do that. Like, they empathize their belly, they focus a bit more of attention, you know. They'd be like, oh, look at me, I'm pregnant, you know, I'm gonna be a mother. Oh, I've been doing that a lot. So, like, even if it's like sitting down, like you're recording from time to time, and just like have my hand on my belly, also, you now and be like, I live like sees me, but like really like that you're pregnant, eh? I'd be like, I also dream that came through once, so maybe my only time, you know. That's the thing. That's the reason why we actually primarily kept it. Uh, that's the that's the main reason we primarily kept. It. We don't know if this is a one-time thing or a multiple-time thing. You know that I can get pregnant multiple times. Uh, I see there was a the rifle fight up here. Uh. Oh. Once a battle. But uh, that's the thing, like... I was like, even if we're walking around the city, it's like, babe. <laughs> like, you just have your hand, like, one hand here, like, holding me, or you're just like, with my shoulders on this thing, you know, when we're walking around, and then he has my... Uh, he has his hand around my shoulder, uh, on my boob. He has a full team? And there's a shadow around my, on my shoulder, my boob, or my boob, you know, because I basically let him, my babe, so, oh, can. And then he's like, your other hand is usually either uh, holding a back or on your belly, but also even it's like holding a back, babe. Then it is like, uh... Then even, like, if you're holding, like, holding a back and, like, you're laying with your hand on my shoulder when we're walking, like, a bit hugging, he's like, even then you're just standing a bit forward with your belly, so that people can see you're pregnant. And this is a weakness, by the way, so... Like, this is a thing! <laughs> Like, that's the thing, like, that's why I realized something, like, you, 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 like, you don't realize it until somebody else say it. Because, uh, of course, I'm pregnant and I want to show my belly off because I'm a pregnant woman, you know, that's what most pregnant women do. They have a tendency to show their belly or put fo focus on their belly, you know. Already quicker than me. You're quicker to be used to thing. Uh, the belly, so I do that a lot too, but it's like, that's like the thing. Somebody else said it and then you realize it. Also, if, like, the thing with my carvings and what I've been recently eating, of course, you'd be like, oh well, at least if you're like eating whole pack of fries with like snacks, we won't blame you. You're like pregnant and eating for two, and then be like, yeah, but I don't wanna. <laughs> I could like be shocked. But the thing's a water type, right? And a ground type. If I'm correctly. That's a curse. But that's the thing, like... Also, it's like, when you... When they, for example, when you realize that I say, like... Uh, 
What is it like? What do I say that? Oh, that doesn't do any damage. Do any damage. I have an idea here. But uh, that's the thing. Like when you do, you know, for example, now, like I've been like eating tea sandwiches for four uh, as breakfast and as afternoon because I'm hungry normally. That's the thing already. Normally I eat two. <laughs> but that's the thing, as I said, like uh, this is gonna be also. It's gonna be a painful issue. Stop, stop setting up. <laughs> so, like I said, that's not the thing. Like, when you say that, and they say also, I had like a board of fries, which is like 500 grams of fries, with, uh, you know, three, which we call an LSV candela. And in the afternoon, I ate like two or three chocolates and, uh, like mini sandwiches. Uh, like, it sounds a lot. But then you realize you're pregnant and you be like, okay, I can, you know, I can walk, I can eat for two. I'm eating for two. So, you know, it's reasonable. I expected this thing to be a problem, not second up five, six times. <laughs> so, but that's like the things I said. When somebody else says it, you sh and you tell it or says it, you'd be like, sh I should, I get sh shocked a bit. You shock yourself. You now, sure, you're surprised. You're su I was surprised because. You know, you, like, you just do it like unconsciously. You do it like on autopilot. Like, I eat more because, yeah, I'm eating for two. You know, I pet my belly a lot or show my belly off a lot because I'm pregnant and that's what most, most pregnant women do. But, like, those are the little things. Yeah, for Forgus. Oh, wait. Forgus is a grass type. He has a lot of grass types. My only issue. Oh, fucking damn it. Mm. Like, as I said, like, those are the little things you do. Well,. Oh wait, you're not a grass type, you're a fairy type. Yeah, you're, you're a fairy type. But you have access to grass moves. But that's the thing, like, little things... Once someone else do it, you'd be like a bit shocked, but you're like, yeah, it's... Something you do, like... A shell bell? Like, I don't know. It's weird. Like, okay, I'm petting my belly a lot, you know, I'm pregnant. Okay. No, I'm eating for two. Okay, but what's the next weird thing that I don't know what I'm doing? And that's also a thing for me. Yeah? Like, I've been, I've been pregnant for the last two months. So pregnancy has been become a bit my life. Yeah, you, you blame it. Almost a bit my life. <laughs> it's not that I'm sitting in the train, you know, and it keep just stares at me because I'm looking, I look good and look thin, you know. No, I have a belly from here to Tokyo. That's fucking damn. That's one thing. Oh yeah, we're gonna talk about uh, being pregnant at school too, because like pregnant internship, you know, delay uh, connections. Uh, but every day in it when I take a train ride to school or to LA of City, people offer me a seat a lot, and the thing is, I appreciate it. But no, like that's ooh. I expect the fighting move coming out probably, or no, it can hit me with any move because basically it's the KO. But that's the thing. Like I said, it will for me a lot of uh, a lot of times, but also every time a spot. On the set, I'm like, I guess it furthermore down the road, but I appreciate it, or madam and sir, you know, I appreciate it. So, the people be like looking at me weird, like, you're pregnant, do you want to sit here? And I go there, and be like, no, I'm pregnant. I, like, like I said, to, I said, I say to them, I'm pregnant, but I can still walk the 500 miles further down the coupe or the train car, you know, I sit there instead of like you walking up. Mm. Oh, I saw it was like a bit of my annoyance. Yeah, stomp. Uh, 
That doesn't do anything. We drew the Drew King. You have three grass Pokemon. You have water those your magnetus. I can't really send out Miko. But that's the thing, like. But then comes the school. Oh, I just need to on. I don't know what sneezes. But that's the thing comes schools on. Like, who's really supportive for me? I'd be like, you sure you wanna go on Elise? You sure you don't have anything special? But like, look, yeah, look, I'm not on a tentacle and I know I'm supposed not to get pregnant and no special powers and that sort of stuff. But the fact that I'm gonna get a, a belly and my boobs become a li little bit bigger, because you know, this happens with pregnancy. Uh, but the fact that I become a little bit bigger. Doesn't matter that I change from personality, I still can program, I still can do my sh stuff. The only real issue for me actually was, uh, was that last week? Yeah, let's see Tuesday. Basically, I had to take two hour train ride to like s the south of Limburg. My boyfriend had to work that day, so he couldn't bring me. But I had like a two hour train ride uh, to the south of Limburg. Because I had a delivery, my end delivery was there. And basically... They do it so as last, you know, last delivery they have like to, uh, they have a metal puns last one. <laughs> oh, I'm hanging out in here, you just. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> fucking metal pot. Did you bring that a better free at this level or something? I don't know. Uh, but, uh, as I said, yeah, I had to take it to our train ride because they have a tradition. That they do the last delivery at their location, and that's in the south of Limburg, literally the south edge, like here in. Um, but it takes a two hour train ride from my home here, because I was not sleeping at Elias' place, which I maybe should have. Oh, sorry, I'm itching my nose a bit. <laughs> so if I'm like itching doing it a lot, then you know where I. So I didn't sleep at like, my boyfriend's place, which I maybe should do. Dowsing machine? Can I get a bike or not? But like that was annoying to do like being pregnant and sitting in a train for like four hours because I had to go two hour back and two hour I got back to my boyfriend's now I went back to uh my own place, so two hours forward to two hours back. Because I went, I went shopping the next day with my mother. Mm. I went shopping the next day with my mother. But uh, basically we had like... Yeah, we basically, you know... It was like a four hour train ride. But school's been supportive, so I really love it. But like, if you need any help, just send me a message. Especially my semester coach was like, if you need any help for your pregnancy at least, just send me a message. But like, ah, thank you, I keep it in mind, but I don't need it because, you know... I don't need it because I have a big wedding, but I still can program, I still can do my work. And I passed it, passed the school semester. I passed it. Well, as I said, I have like one more, uh, if everything goes right, I have one more, or one or one more semester, which is six months, and then I'm basically graduated. I'm a full-time software developer girl who bears to be pregnant at this point. If I, and uh, I do apologize a bit, but I've been talking the, the past 35 minutes about my pregnancy and that sort of stuff. Uh, on the battle. Like the Edwin. <laughs> as I said, I do apologize, but as I said, it's my life. So if you don't like it, I apologize, but give me a reason, okay? Give me a blade. <laughs> uh, oh wait, I should uh, switch to tiny land. Uh, but as I said, like, if it's supportive, like, I, I passed it, so I now have to like, I have an internship appointment, but I still have to mill them back because basically they didn't mill me today. Uh, I mailed them with the idea of like, 
I built them like a... I did that last Friday. With the idea of like, if I finish my semester, you know, past it, I sent them a... If I didn't pass it or did, I sent them a mail so that we could sign the contract. Or in case if I didn't pass it, it was like to know, let them know. I, like, I don't... I, I didn't make it, sorry. It was nice knowing at least you. Maybe next half year I can go. Come, you know. I make it so I built on Friday, but I'm thinking if the, if I don't have more earning after doing groceries, they will mill with LEF because LEF is basically uh, is driving towards here. It should be around here in like 30 to 45 minutes. So, cool, to red, uh, which is a ground type. So, oh, then I should go to hold on, let's go to Luca. But as I said, he's coming here, and then tomorrow we're gonna do groceries together. He's sleeping here, and he, like I said, cut, I can cuddle with him again after a weekend away. <laughs> Got to work, but he's like, uh, he usually works in this town where he lives. And which is not a lot, yeah, which, is, which is quite some far away, so it's like a good 45 minute drive from where he works. He said it like, he left like 15 minutes ago, he said he's gonna pack and leave, which takes him about an hour, he said, so. Time for me to record, huh? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's cool. Like, I have to, like, I have to go to internship. I, as I said, if we didn't go this tomorrow and I didn't get, like, a mail back, I'm gonna mail them again and maybe call them. Be like, hey, I passed my semester and I mailed you two times. It, you know, didn't come true. So, I don't want you to learn courage. So, uh, that's the thing. But imagine, I have to go working. I, I probably have some less time for content creation, but I still want to do, like, keep uh, in the upcoming semester, even while, um, like I said, even while I am pregnant. I'm still going to be, like, uh, like, I'm still going to try to make content as I normally do. That's my goal. Even while I'm pregnant, I'm going to make content. Hehe. <laughs> I was getting tired, cheap. <laughs> uh, getting tired, really tired. Oh, good. Uh, but the thing is, as I said, I'm gonna still be making content, but probably have some less time for it. Uh, because. Well, I have to focus on, like, making a portfolio, uh, you know, keep my work together, you know, make it clean up and such stuff. Which is going to take a lot of time, so I'm still going to try to at least to do three days a week. With one day being... A psychic type. Fighting against it. Uh, so as I said, I'm going to try to at least do three uploads a week. With one uh, being Project Eva, one being a Let's Play, one uh, being Horror Friday. Which is basically a double upload. Or I'm gonna try. Which I'm not gonna work to see if it works, but we'll see. Yeah, we'll see if we'll try. Oh. I draw a fairy type? Oh well. Uh but yeah, of course I can have less time to record and maybe you have to go less time streaming. You have a substitute. I have a substitute. Joker Fu- oh. <laughs> But, yeah, and then if, if that's done, you know, I'll pass that semester in one go. And this pregnant girl has to go work. I don't know if my... I heard something, but I'm not sure. You know. Why? I swear to f... You are the most annoying Mr. Mom I ever have seen. Or you're gonna use Reflect again, because I'm a physical attack. You have a bite coming. Better plus through this again. I swear to God, Rin. God. 
Little side beams confusions there. How high is the chance? Oh, and it's quicker than me. This fucking Mr. Mime is killing my whole team. Because <laughs> it's confusing the others. For fuck's sake. <laughs> But yeah, then this Peggy girl has to go work. And I don't know yet if I uh, I heard something, but I don't know for sure because I also didn't ask yet. Because uh, I really didn't want to ask at the beginning because I can be a terrible, uh, you know, I can be a terrible, what do you call it? A terrible employee. I can be a terrible employee and, you know, they hate me and they don't want to take me. Or, I can be like, you know, a good employee and be like, is there a possibility to work here after? Because I do have to go find some work, which is going to take some time away from my content creation a lot. Because I'm going to be more tired and that sort of stuff, you know. Uh, and also, I have to, you know find a new apartment because I'm basically living in a student room now and of course I can go live with Elliot but I'd rather find my first apartment still because you never know because you never know like I don't think Elliot and me uh, basically are gonna be like ever break up so, uh, before I continue the story, let's read this. Wow, so this is Malfoy City. Ha uh ha, -huh, you seem to be enjoying the volley. So what would you like to do? Do you want to grab a bite to eat at Malfoy Food Court? Maybe to go get your bike of your own at Rydal Cycles. Would you like that? A better exercise will be good for your health. And thank you, I want to challenge the gym right away. What? Let me see, I'm pretty sure the gym is... Yep, straight ahead that way, just through the internet courtyard. Hey, wait, Molly! You must for a to attend it down to the corridor the start with unique road to refine cycling road and the trick house. But as I said, I don't think I live and we will break up, but you know, I never had my own rental apartment. Like I'm living in a student room at, at the moment, I'm still saying. Yeah, I'm pregnant and in a student room. Oh, I'm more so. But, uh, where's the focus center? We need focus center. Right? Yo. And for City Gym, Rydal Cycles. Oh, the Poker City. Poker Gym. But as I said, uh, yeah. I, I don't know, I felt like I talked with Elif about this. My boyfriend, of course. I talked with my babe about this. He was like, I get you, Elise. And if you want, like, your own rental apartment first, I, I fully support it. It's like, uh, you live a lot here. And you have your own, you know, recording studio at this place. I do. That's really sweet. My only place and he made it like a Christmas girly team. I love it. Uh. <laughs> uh. I have recorded some videos from there. Really well. Did I? I don't know if I did. Uh. So. He was like, I will, I will help you move if you need to. And you know, we'll find something for you. And I was like, yeah, you're the best. And I gave him a kiss on the team. And like, that's my babe. And I was like, I was not my head a lot. Yeah, the light doesn't uh, take this well for some reason. I don't know, light. And I think it's my hair, but oh well. That was something in my head. I was like, Duke, shoot. Now I guess my Pokemon. But oh well. So this is my first rental apartment. It's gonna take some time, you know. So if I if I you know graduate across. Uh, in February, then expect some less content because I have to move and go on the rent room and go on a lot of, uh, you know, job offers. But who knows? Maybe I have to, can stay with the company. I'm like having an internship of having a really nice uh, internship and they keep me around and they help me around, you know, and that sorts of stuff. 
knows? I, think they, I hope they will actually. Okay, I will finally have a battle with you. If I can go do it to the gym next. And sure. The full team! Like, the thing is, like, uh, before I go on with my, like, my life story about, like, graduating and that sorts of stuff, uh, my team has one week, like, it's very one time diverse, like, counter water. So, I need some diversity. That's why I was thinking capturing the Veltal. Because this team needs some things. So, but, like, and we decided, okay, so, like, we're gonna focus on your turnership first, Elise. And was like, I know, I I'm gonna do. And we'll see what happens, like, three, two months in. Power punch. Uh, and then we'll see, babe, you know, see what do because you're probably become more partner and other sort of stuff. You can mood swings. But yeah, that's also a bit. You have a guard job? Red card? <laughs> They have items! Oh, this is the worst pick. This is the worst pick, actually. It was the worst pick. I expect the Dragon Robert to come and hurt because Luca is Dragon uh, Ice. But the Ice is gonna be the one that I need. I outspeed? Yes. It should kill. Like me, at all. You have a guard jump! But yeah, like as I said, Elif also said, like... You don't know whatever what happens in the next three months after your internship. Maybe it becomes really, really good, maybe it becomes really, really bad. And my priority is the rental. I think my internship at the moment. Uh, making sure... I sent! What the fuck? What the fuck, Wally? <laughs> That's gonna hurt. I expect an ancient power again. Who can take an ancient power? Again. Uh, oh okay. yeah. I don't know what comes, and this pregnant, like I said, internship is a lot, and of course I'm pregnant now, never expected. Uh, so... That's one thing, like, I think all of this would have been fine with Ellie if this pregnancy was not a thing. But yeah, we decided to keep it. Uh, you, like, you never know, this is gonna be my only time I get, can be pregnant and have a child. Like, we don't, we're not sure if we're gonna keep it yet. Well, yeah, that's been my life for the past few weeks. Been a lot, and I've been talking a lot about my pregnancy you know, with the world. Uh. Hey, Mika drew to her level! Nice. I don't need crap now, I'm not, and always can read. AM which moves can be forgotten now. What the fuck? Oh, I can't learn slash. No, I don't want to move. No, keep old moves. Yes. You have a Zapdos, you have a Garchomp, you have a Hoopa. What's next?
Their power swap is skill swap, okay, but yeah. Like, I think the thing I'm worried the most about at the moment is not my school, but my pregnancy. Because, uh, as I said, I've been a lot of power things, uh, you know, just mood swings, that sort of stuff. Clothing that doesn't fit anymore, and I have to get new clothing, which costs a lot, but I live is paying for the post a bit because he's the one who made me pregnant, of course. But, yeah, that's the most worrying thing. Like, I enjoy. Fight beam, okay. Like, I enjoy being pregnant. But. The bliss, I don't know. Like, I enjoy the aspect of it, but. Like, when I got, like, uh. After, of course, the few. The few. Plus, toy. So bad. Okay. Find poison. Don't kill. Okay. Nice. But, uh, as I said, like. I live pays a lot of the cloth for my dresses, uh, care, taking care of me and that sort of stuff because it's a real sweet art set. But of course, I became pregnant of him, or we expected this is, because uh, basically he's the only one I had sex with. But that lines up, like, as I said, uh, I've been pregnant for around two months now. Or my belly showed up for two months, so, but it is at this point we confirmed with uh, Anna, my gynecologist, that it has been pregnancy. But, uh, poor chick. That's the last one. But as I said, like, we've been confirmed with Emma, like, uh, with Emma, was it Emma or Emma? Forgot. Fuck's sake. I think it was Emma. Yeah. Uh, Emma. It was Emma, my apologies. I forgot. <laughs> been in a few weeks. Uh, but as I said, like, it lines up, like, a few months ago. Uh, me and Elliot were swimming, and basically after swimming we were laying down on the beach on, uh, on a towel. I of course in my bikini in a swimming suit, and when we were laying there, you know, dying a bit of chilling, I got a bit moody and, you know, started kissing him and, and it left, you know, it went out. I started kissing him and we started, you know, kissing doing it on the beach and... You know how it goes. You know how it goes further because I can't say it on Twi uh, YouTube, I think, because my video gets demonetized. <laughs> Basically, we had sex as a couple, and in the upcoming weeks after that, like three weeks after that, I, I got such morning sickness. Eh? I was such I was sick for a week. I also like I was still going to school, but I stayed at home and worked from home. Basically, because I thought I had such a such a problem with morning sickness in those two weeks. Uh, so. That was such a thing, but that should have been a moment for me to be like, okay, I have morning sickness for a few weeks, am I pregnant? But you don't think about that because, well, I'm a transgender girl, as I said. Even in my transformation, I'm still a um, transgender girl, but yeah. As I said, I had sex with Ellie in the Sekai, and basically, that's why I believe it is his child that I'm carrying. Because I basically would end up sex with anyone else. For that because we were like dating we we're a couple so if you're a couple you're not gonna have sex with someone else unless you know you do a threesome or your partner uh, counts like votes again votes in with like doing a threesome with someone out of the out of the thing rock smash But basically, that's the thing. I don't want me to heal again. Like, that was the thing, like, uh, yeah, we had sex in Isekai, but... We're a couple! You know, don't blame us. Like, if you're a couple of 16, okay, it's something different, but... I'm 24. Oh, I'm 24, he's 26. He's like a few years older than me. You know... I feel like, I feel like, why, why am I feel like I'm... And that I shouldn't be. <laughs> no. Like I shouldn't be a few offended because, <laughs> you know, I get moody from time to time too. And it so happened that one time sex at that beach, you know, where I started with kissing him uh, while we are laying down on the beach and it all, you know, got out to like, a bit more. Okay, happened.
Bit of well. Oh, this is. Oh, I don't want to fight him. But I have to. Can I just fall? No. Thing. Uh -huh. So, yeah, okay, for a couple, we have sex from time to time, you know. Two or two. And I don't want to go in detail more. You can you can imagine it yourself if I start, I started kissing him on the beach and, and you know. You can imagine your own things. <laughs> People in the comments will be like, Elise, don't, please don't elaborate further on the top. You know, my comment section now is going to be uh, two different things. Three different. Are people will be like, uh, Elise, please don't elaborate further on your sex story. You know. Confusely. Maybe. We're going to have this again. I wanna have this again. That's all I fault, again. Uh but like I said uh, like like I said, the comments section is gonna be like people as I said, people will be like, don't elaborate any further, please, Elise. There are people who will be like, Yeah, Elise, I get you, you're a couple, you know, they do you know at one point you're gonna have a moody time and have sex with each other. And there are people who down there will be like Please, Elise, can you talk further? It was a nice story. Oh, I said, as uh, we're laying at the beach after swimming, uh, I started kissing him. I went on top of him. And uh, when, I, when I kissed him, and from there it went further. You can, the rest, you can imagine the rest. You can imagine the rest. This video is so going to be demonetized. But, uh, you know. He's just going to so be demonetized, so. But like I said, it lines up with like my uh, pregnancy or my expected belly, which is that basically with my general gynecologist Emma prompted, uh, but uh, with my pregnancy, because well, I got morning sickness in those two weeks I had, or three weeks, and after that I got my belly, so I have to move by simp. But no, the gym doesn't have any phone puzzles. So, but yeah, that's the thing. And that's what I'm worrying about because I don't know what's up for me. Like, I'm a transgender girl. It's not that I'm a normal woman, you know, who got pregnant. No. But I'll get through it, I know, I know, I don't really come to you don't know, worry about me. Like I said, my combo section is going to be three things. Just horny people. Be like, please, at least tell your story further. And there are going to be people who are like, oh, I get you at least, you know, you're just a couple, you do stuff do, and from time to time. But also, don't worry, you'll get through it. With, uh, how do I say? you get through it, girl. You know, you'll make it, don't worry about it, you're going to have a pleasant time with pregnancy. And there are people who be like, at least what you told the date, no, that never do it again. <laughs> uh. But like, that's the thing, like, so some videos, uh, some videos talk away, and I've been talking for like the past hour, basically. So, wait. Huh? Oh, we have to remove the red one. Why? Oh no, I have to go this way. Uh, but like I said, I'm not gonna have a three week wait conversation. But you have to understand, yeah, I'm not gonna tell the details of the sex I have with Elif because that's against TOS. But uh, that's against YouTube TOS, so I apologize. If you want that, you go to, you know, there are plenty of sites out there where you can watch your adult content on. So, but uh, as a part of me, you know, my life also being pregnant. So. Because basically, yeah, that's the thing that I hate and watch. Because I had once time a conversation with my mother uh, that I basically don't talk about, uh, you know, like the thing is, 
he can talk with me on this channel, and I'm gonna talk a lot about sex now, but uh, as long as I keep it at this level, I assume it's okay. And if my thing gets, you know, if my thing gets demonetized, so be it. I don't make any money on YouTube anyway, so. Uh, but I had a conversation with my mother, and was like, why don't you talk about sex on your channel, Twitch channel, and YouTube, etc. And it's simply it's allowed against the US. So I can say that, you know, I had sex with a person. And uh, I'm not going into detail or much. I only said that I kissed him and I went on top of him. And the rest you can imagine. I think that is already too much actually. So. I think that's already too much actually. <laughs> uh, okay, I just went on top of him kissing. Well, kissing. Okay, you know. I don't say anything more. But. Uh. The thing is, like, if you say to me, for example, I had sex with a girl, you know, you, you know, we did the lesbian thing with your sister. This video is getting, like I said, the video is going to get monetized. <laughs> Do anything. It's a part dragon type. Why don't they use... Uh, uh but... Uh, that's actually already too much, because basically that's against the OS, I, I believe I'm right. I'm not allowed to talk about or show graphic content. If, it, for example, I show nudity in a game, I'm only allowed to show the much, uh, that much which is needed to pass uh, the section. So I'm not allowed to show more. So, you know. And I don't know exactly how it's on YouTube, I have to look into it. But if I could talk about my pregnancy, you know, and that sort of stuff, then... And, if I would explain, like, if I was allowed to talk about this type of stuff, if you were to like, oh, I had sex with a girl, and I think I'm lesbian, that's okay, you know? I think you can say on this uh, on this YouTube platform that you have sex with somebody, like a girl or a boy, and, uh, because they're still part of the LGBT community, yeah? That's a shit, that's very... But, uh, yeah. I don't know what's on YouTube. And I know at the moment you're gonna say, make it, uh, I don't know how far you can talk about it before getting punished. And I'd ra rather find out. So, but, I'd rather be safe, you know. Not that I, like I said to my mother, it's not that I wouldn't want to talk about the people with it. And if you want to talk about such experience, for example, you had like sex with a girl, but you want to talk about it with someone, you can uh, throw my DMs full, but you know, I'm just also a stranger on the internet. Uh, oh, I don't want to ding. Hold on, no, uh, but this is the thing I said if you're on top of me, you can do it in my Discord DMs, but just also note if you don't trust it and don't want it, don't feel obliged. I don't feel necessary to do, but because I'm still a stranger on the internet, I'm still a pregnant stranger on the internet for you, huh? So, so does she know? I have potions, because I don't want to walk back all the way. How do you, how do you move in this list? <laughs> I have one max potion. I'm not gonna heal, and maybe that's gonna cost me that cost me this, but but as I said, like yeah, I want to talk about sometimes, but I don't want to encourage it, and then my chat and my community is full of like people who are like, oh, you know, I did this with a girl when I had sex with her, and I did that, and I did that, I really liked it, you know, they just get a sort of kink server, and that's all, and. That's, that's something I don't want. I want an LGB community who can feel uh, safe around itself and talk about it publicly in a server. Because that's the reason I am so open about my transgendership, uh, transgender part. Because, yeah, I want to be the a community. Like, I saw this with Rinchu. I don't know if, if she still uploads to YouTube. That's, that's basically. Uh, I saw the entire community once. We should be talking about gender fluence and pronunci pronunciations. And. Fuck's sake, you doof. 
the power of God. When she was talking about like gender and pronouns and stuff, and everyone was just like fully safely talking about it, and was like, that's something I want. That's something I want in the future, my channel. I know I have to come for it, so. But you have to talk open. But that's the thing. You can't talk about anything. So I don't want to gank her. It is you on. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it. But, uh... Pick up Kaito. Nice. But that's the thing, like... I don't want a king server. I want to, like I said, I want to feel... I have a uh, legal community where LGP, Q plus people can feel safe. They can feel that they can start anything about. But, like, that sex thing, as I said, is a thing which is part of the community. But... Uh... Charizard? Do I risk staying in with my plus six Kaito or I'm gonna fake it out? Failed! Oh, I'm dead. That was a move I didn't. Make. But uh Yeah, that's the thing. Like Do I talk about it with people or not? But like when I go to King and when I became pregnant or show that I had my belly, I doubted the show I was like doubting the show on Twitch a lot because I don't know. I know, it's like... I should have seen a comment that was flying. I'm doing. Uh, the thing was... Pregnancy... Yeah, it is how you take it, but... Ali have warned me. Even when I'm outside alone. Is that a white power herb? That's a super potion, okay. We attack, I hope. But that's the thing, like, pregnancy can be... I know a lot of... I know it's out there, but pregnancy also is, like, a well-known kink. So, Ali was first against it that I showed my baby belly bump on Twitch. Because he was like, people are gonna kink on you, and people are gonna like you only because you're like, have a baby belly bump, and only gonna be like, because you're pregnant. And that's his worrying, like, uh, worrying caretaking part, you know. Oh, my own enemy. Like, that's, that's my own. Uh, this is like, he cares a lot about me, especially since I'm quite pregnant. Uh, even if I go out of the door alone, he wants to like, oh, at me when you arrived at your uh, school or something, and be like, buddy. So, but that's the thing, like, I've been talking a lot. You're a you have a rock slide. But that's the thing, like, uh, now I've been talking normally about LGBTQ plus stuff, my pregnancy life in the last hour, and of course, uh, I've been talking about sex a bit, or with hope within the TOS. Things, you know. Which is a lot of it in TOS. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. But. Uh, yeah. And. Like it's soccer. In this way. It can be. Uh, received wrong. But. Like I had the I had the discussion with one of my viewers on Twitch. Uh like where do you take the line of when it becomes talking about a pregnancy be a king? Or does such a stuff or can be expected wrong? And where should I like cover myself? Of course that I had you know, I had sex with Elliot, I shouldn't uh describe it as much as I did. I only described the kissing part, so don't worry, but I think you can imagine that. But this is also logical, because the baby I'm carrying has to come from someone, you know? It has to come from someone. Even if it's not Elliot, then 
I, I have to get, I've got an event one way or the other, the baby in my stomach, but... Oh well, be a fake out. Do I expect this Elliot? I should ask him to fake out, but I don't think so. Like, as I said, and that's why, as I said that... Uh, this is a set, like, it lines up. Lines up with, time, with a sort of timeline. So, that's why I expect Eli that I'm carrying Ellie of Shell, but, like, like Ellie also said, like, I shouldn't share anything, like. Okay, maybe I shouldn't uh, start this one. What's your last Pokemon? A Surge Kid. We have Aqua Jet. I forgot if this is Party Book. Oh well. So, yeah. Just let me know in the comments down below what you think of my hour long conversation. And it's been an hour and 11 minutes. I said that earlier, this is the thing that I sometimes have, that you start talking, you talk, 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 you talk to the whole video. Because basically this was my goal for the video. You're paraly uh, paralyzed. God damn it, look, I need this breakthrough because I'm not of, not of my other Pokemon are. Sticky map. Oh wait, there's a water type. Well, because like I said, you start talk. I sometimes a video where I don't know what to talk about. You just play the game and you just focus on the game, you know. Sometimes I have videos like this where I start talking about my pregnancy for a lot. And uh, I, you know, I start talking about my pregnancy a lot, about things I maybe shouldn't talk. And how I think about life and my me and my boyfriend. Uh, but, uh, well, yeah. And then we're here. So just let me know in the comments below, below what you think. And when you're down there, subscribe, ring the notification bell. So I know I should do more of these videos. And I know what I thought today is uh, is not a bad thing, but a good thing. So let me know. And when you're down there, like, uh, subscribe, ring the notification bell. If you want to know, uh, I do have a Discord down below. Like, if you want to know, I have a Discord down below. In that Discord, you can like uh, stay up to date with my uh, with my story. If you have any questions on what I do or what happens, you can always ask me. If you want to talk about some LGBTQ plus community stuff, uh, here are a lot. You can talk to me with that if you want to. Like I'm still a stranger on the internet, so don't feel obliged to. I'm happy listening here, but uh, this is where I'm gonna end the video. It's been an hour and fifty minutes, long enough. I'm not gonna do this the next time again. So, but. Or beat the dirt chimp. I'm talking about pregnancy, sex, kink, that sort of stuff, but you know, you know. I made some mistakes I think, but pregnancy mood. Pregnancy mood. But as I said, if you want to stay up to date, I have a Discord down below. This best place to stay up to date. I also stream from time to time if you're interested, make sure to check out my socials or my Discord. In my Discord you get a more localized stem so you don't have to do the converting. Benefit of my Discord. And you can make suggestions in my Discord also what I should do on this channel. But as I said, let me know in the comments down below if this episode talk was a bit of a mess. Or if I shouldn't do this again. Or not. You know, tell me if I should do or do not. I'm not going to tell that I have sex with Ellie every time. This should be a common sense, but... Because she seems I'm pregnant. <laughs> but uh, like I said, just let me know in the comments down below. If this, what I did in... Uh, what I talked about in this video, especially... Uh, the topic regarding sex. If I should talk about like, or should I allow having sex in my channel, in my community. Where, it's, if it fits within the TOS. Let me know in the comments down below. Was this a mess? Was this good? Should I do this more often? Uh, talk more like this. Because I'm really interested in what people think. About this. Because, been all over the place. But, I don't know. Uh, as I said, I'm gonna end it here. Because we beat the dirt gym, that was my goal for today, in an hour and 50 minutes. This, uh, if you want to know, this hour episode is going to be an hour. But as I said, I have a Discord down below, best place to stay up to date. If you like what you saw, leave a comment down below, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Let me especially know uh, 
what you thought thought about what I talked about in this video. I hope you heard it. I hope it was loud and clear because I do know my mic sometimes doesn't pick up everything correctly. So with that, I'm gonna say have a wonderful day. I think I heard my uh, babe coming in, so that means I'm, I have to do go for it now. And I'll see you all in the next Pokemon adventure. But don't forget leave, leave a comment down below because I'm really interested. So have a nice day and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye. Bye.